Yesterday, Sha'Carri Richardson made her long-awaited return to the track, and she did not disappoint. After nearly two and a half months of not running, she found herself going up against a very star-studded field with Elaine thompson Hara, Jenna Prandini, and Kambuji. She ends up getting the win over Elaine thompson Hara with a time of 11.29. Elaine Thompson runs an 11.30. Clara Barnes, 11.40. Jenna Prandini, 11.48. Uh, Demps 11.50, Kambuji 11.54, Shania Collins 11.59. Keep in mind it was rainy and they were going into a negative 2.0 headwind so that 11.29 translates to roughly an 11.15 depending on what calculator you're using. But this was a big time win when it comes to Shakari. She now has a victory against all of the Jamaican runners so she is 3-1 versus Shelly and Fraser Price. She is 1-2 against the lame Thompson hurrah and she's one and two against Sharika Jackson so she has now officially gotten a win against all three of the Jamaicans and this was a really good race for her it was very very close through the entire race it was neck and neck her and Elaine going at it the entire time and yes the time wasn't anything crazy that we thought we would see but the fact that she's able to get this win after nearly two and a half months laid off is big time like this is something that you want to have and lends me to believe that what she's going to be doing on Friday versus an even better field is looking to be really, really impressive because that's going to be a Diamond League meet. And so she, if she can come out with another win or another top three performance going up against Shelly Ann Fraser Price, Tolu, Dina Asher Smith, that gives me a lot of belief that it's a possibility. And this brings up the, the question why? 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 Is she getting so much hate or why does she get so much? FaceTime over all of these other athletes. Many people think, hey, she hasn't won anything. She shouldn't be getting all of this credit because there's other athletes that have run faster, have done this, blah, 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 blah. Well, she's getting all of this FaceTime. She's getting all this credit because she's a star. There was a New York Times article talking about this where, you know, the it's not just about the times that you're running. It's about the flash. It's about the, the appeal that you have. Like, you not only do you have to win, you have to win in style. And she does that. Like, she has the style, she has the appeal for a big audience. She, you know, she talks trash, she's confident, she has fun, she dances around, like that's what people like. It's polarizing. Some people like it a lot, a lot of people hate it. But either way, you're tuning in. And the best thing to do if you're a celebrity, if you're a professional athlete, if you're like this, you want to have people talking about you. You know the, the saying, no bat, no, there's no such thing as bad press? Sha'Carri Richardson's taking that in stride. Because people are talking about her all the time. It doesn't matter where you go. She doesn't even have to run in a race. She is getting talked about. And so she is doing this thing the right way. If and you're only able to be a professional athlete for so long, you're not gonna be able to do it forever. And so if you're always able to be in the public eye, you're always able to have people talking about you, that's the best thing. She's able to do it and she's able to be herself. Great way to get a win here. I'm excited to see what the future holds for her. But as you guys know, I'm a Sha'Carri Richardson fan. I am. I was pleasantly surprised with how this race went. I didn't think she was going to be able to get the win. I thought it was going to be probably a top three situation. But the fact that she did get the win here, I feel really good. And it gives me even better confidence going into Friday and having her chances of getting into the Diamond League final. Because man, uh, you're going up against some big cats there. You're going up against some big cats. And so she's able to, to come out with you know, a 10-9 uh, type race, I think that we're gonna see some good competition.